we do know from several other countries as well that one needs to tackle the epidemic from sev- several angles, right? To flatten the curve. You need to do testing, tracking, quarantine, isolation. Did Kerala do anything different? Did all these other countries that flatten the curve, did they also use coconut oil? So one cannot jump simply jump to the uh, causation argument that it that is very unscientific, right? Just because Kerala happens to have a coincidence of coconut oil. One study suggests that uh, coconut oil enhances immunity, but simply by measuring secondary parameters, we cannot say that it directly immu- boosts our immunity against COVID-19. The novel coronavirus is made up of a nuclear protein complex, uh, which is genetic material, and a lipid coating called the envelope. Okay, It is suggested that this lipid envelope is broken down by lauric acid, which is in coconut oil, because there is no direct evidence that this acts on the virus itself. Uh, however, when coconut oil is fermented or lipolyzed, there are some derivatives that form that do possess some antibacterial uh, properties. There are no effects of virgin coconut oil, the kind that we buy off the shelf in the market. There is no effect of virgin coconut oil as an antimicrobial agent. So I would say that coconut oil cannot ideally protect us from COVID-19. Even if it were effective, and even if we were to use the oil in our nose, nose or nasal cavities or something, the mucus in our nasal cavity will not allow the coated oil to remain there. So essentially, it cannot block the virus later. For that matter, this oil doesn't even enter our lungs, right? And the virus, that is where the virus causes most damage. And uh, God forbid that if someone inhales a spray, a fine spray of coconut and the oil does enter our lungs, the oil if it coats our alveoli, the oxygen will not be able to enter our lungs and it will render our lungs ineffective. So that person will essentially die of suffocation. So it is better to avoid allowing coconut oil to enter your lungs. The coconut oil, by virtue of being derived from plants, is cholesterol free, just like all other vegetable oils, sunflower oil and you name it. Right. So for some people who have health related problems, maybe consuming vegetable oil is a safer option. However, consuming any oil in moderation, along with a balanced diet, is the way to good health, not specifically consuming coconut oil or specifically consuming or specifically massaging with some kind of oil. Uh, 